Hey everyone, welcome to Auction 29. Can't believe we've done 29 of these, and uh, yeah, happy to say this week's selection is, is pretty epic. Uh, again, we've got some lovely pieces from uh, Ikarashi Izumi, uh, one of my go-to farms, a farm that I really, really have admiration for. Lots of variety, that's the exciting thing that I always found when you go to Ikarashi Izumi. Uh, you know, one of the founders of the Benny Kiko, the, and, Kikikikurio lineages in Japan. Fantastic Asagi, Benny Ginga, Benny Komomaru. Yeah, lots of variety, lots of oddities. So yeah, I think for a lot of uh, hobbyists, it's a farm that really stands out. So if we take a look at the individual pieces we've got on offer, I mean, one thing that really stands out is the skin quality. Benny Kiko, I hope this comes across in the video, but the skin, the skin quality is epic on this. Couldn't look past this fish. Again, hopefully it's displayed, but Kikakurio, absolutely wild. Probably a fish that a lot of people would look over, but yeah, for me, just that skin quality alone. Sumi's gonna do its thing, I have no mistake about that. Ginrin Asagi, again, full lateral pattern. And uh, Ginga, obviously a lot of people are sort of quite familiar with uh, Benny Ginga. But this is a variety that the farm excels in also. And then just a casual sort of five step Goshki as well, just to throw into the mix. Another variety that the farm is, is pretty hot on. Uh, Deut Sanki here, yeah. One, one for uh, people that have got a bit of vision with this one. You see the Sumi style that's coming up. You see it all sat underneath the skin. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be a piece moving forward. So yeah, super little fish. So yeah, just a small selection there of some of the high quality bits we've got on the farm. And uh, yeah, hopefully uh, people will agree with me. We've got some nice fish up for offer and uh, yeah, nice starting points as well. We've got some staples here at Koi Wholesale this year. Sakai Kahaku, smaller piece than the others, but yeah, nonetheless intricate. Really nice head pattern on this fish. Sakai Sankey, again, you just see this Sumi style, sat underneath the skin. Nice body line to it, good structured fish. Then a couple of uh, Odakan Showa, which we've been really impressed with this year. When they come in, probably, to the untrained eye, a little bit over underwhelming. Not a lot sue me up. But you can see the Danichi genetics and this sort of lineage coming through. Yeah, again, nice pond fish. Plenty of development here. Lots of subo sue me. Nice bit of character on the face in both pieces actually. So again, just waiting for the memoir to come through on this. Nice motoguru in the fins. Yeah, overall, nice bowl of pond fish there. 